It's perhaps a, an unwanted reminder of uh, all the cash flows and the business dealings that underpin the global vaccine rollout. But it is a reminder, of course, that this is essentially a, a, a business that needs to be kept afloat and pharmaceutical companies are out to make a, a profit, whether it's a large profit or a small, small profit. And of course that raises a whole raft of different ethical questions as well. But according to uh, the latest contract between Pfizer, Moderna and the European Union, there will be a price hike for their shots uh, in the imminent future. According to uh, figures seen by the Financial Times, the new price for a Pfizer shot will be $23, up from $18. Moderna will go up to $25.50, up, uh, up from $22.60. Uh, this, of course, as EU countries are very keen and anxious to stamp out uh, the spread of the Delta uh, variant. It also comes at a time in which uh, countries uh, in the EU and beyond the EU are mulling the possibility of uh, administering a third dose, a booster jab to improve efficacy. So far, only Israel has approved use of a third dose, a booster jab uh, in the over 60s. We know that research is happening uh, here in the UK and um, Britain and other countries may well follow suit. And all of this, of course, means uh, a potential uh, windfall for both uh, Moderna uh, and uh, Pfizer as well. After phase three trials, both of these vaccines have been proven to be more effective than their rivals, than the AstraZeneca uh, jab and the uh, Johnson & Johnson jab. So essentially, uh, both of these companies have a captive audience uh, in the European Union. The European Commission, just to remind you, of course, was accused early on of not acting quickly enough when it came to the a vaccine rollout and what it's doing now is proving that it's willing to throw an awful lot of money at buying a premium product that uh, is proven to work across the board. According to one figure who was close to the negotiations, said, uh, he said that the companies had capitalised on their market power and deployed the usual pharma rhetoric. Essentially, the vaccines work, time to ramp up the price.